In this lesson, let's see how we can create a child and parent flow. Okay, for that, if you see here on the left side, you can see solutions here. Okay, according to Microsoft, a child flow is the flow that is nested inside the parent flow and contains the smaller tasks you want to run. Okay, and a parent flow is a flow can have any type of trigger and will call into the child flow. Okay. So for this let's uh, go to solutions here and click new solution and display name here more options will be seen here in the publisher you can type default publisher here and you can type uh, here in the list solution click newly create solution with the name here you can mention like uh, my new solution okay now click create so here our solution will appear here and enter into the new solution here and after entering into the new solution first we will create a child flow okay so click new and go to here cloud flow okay so now let's add a manually trigger a flow and here you can write here respond to a power app or flow here next step respond to a power app or flow okay here the response you can keep like uh, success okay so and save this as a child flow okay so click save now and now i created this is child flow now we need to create a, the flow in the same solution and name it as a parent flow go to the solutions again wait let it can save is saving now taking some time and now it's saved and let's go to the solutions and again into the solutions let's go to our solution my solution my new solution again we can see the child flow here again go new click new and click cloud flow now we need to create a flow in the same solution and name it as parent flow here and from the parent flow now let's try to uh, in the same flow where we will call it child flow here in the actions now we can notice uh, let's see whether we can see any child flow here yes whatever we have created the child flow it is coming here now okay it means it will work so now do one thing go to the triggers here and uh, here let's manually trigger a flow so in the manually trigger a flow or now take the response we can we can run this or uh, whatever we want here now uh, um, new step and here run a child flow let's see whether our child flow is there okay so child flow select a flow so we have created already a child flow it will show the one child flow and in the new step get the response from the child flow so using the compose um, in the inputs i will give the run a child flow here response and now click save the parent flow and let's run this parent flow once and see what is the output we are getting test it manually test run flow 
and it will run the child flow and we will get the response as success done and this child flow ran which is inside of the parent flow and it is giving the output status response success and we captured in the com compose and you can see the success this is how we can uh, create the child flows and parent flows in the new solutions okay thank you